What's goody fam? It's your girl Blue Phoenix and I'm back with another video for you guys. What's goody big energy fam? Oh shit. Mm -mm. We can't be starting off the reading like that now with snakes and shit. Anyway, hi. <laughs> if you're new here, I'm Blue Phoenix. Thanks so much for visiting the channel. And if you're a returning subscriber, what it do boo? What's goody? How y'all doing? What's going on? So, yeah, your girl had to switch up a little bit today. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm sure if you're new here, you're like, what the fuck? What is she talking about? Anyway, yeah, I had to get on my Queen of Wands shit today, right? But anyway, y'all, let me let me focus. Y'all know my ADHD first video of the day. Shit be all over the place, right? So, um, we're going to get it together, though. Thanks for your patience. If you need a personal reading, make sure y'all drop down in the description box. Um, and I try to remember to put it in the pinned comments, but if not, it's definitely in the description box. Um, I do have, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> this same thing happened yesterday. Something like my throat chakra gets all <clears throat> fucked up, hold up. I always take that as like, either something don't want me to get this message out or someone don't want you to get a message out or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Something's trying to stop the word from coming through, right? <laughs> anyway, don't forget. Look at this shit. I'm telling you. Look, nah. Good guy. You got the five of pentacles, the two of swords, and the two of cups. 22 masters around this bitch. Anyway, don't forget to like the video, y'all. If, um, damn, and then 11. All right, now this is feeling very karmatic to me, very much, um, not like karma, but you know, like a cycle in life, something you may be mastering, okay? Mm-hmm, something like that. Mm, Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Anyway, uh, yeah, like the video, comment down below, subscribe, share the video. All those things, y'all, really, um, they really help me out in the algorithm they help the channel out in the algorithm and it really just blesses me you know what i'm saying if you can't give monetarily definitely give a little bit of your energy and hit one of them damn buttons okay <laughs> no nah, real talk i appreciate you guys though everything y'all send to me i pray god returns to y'all times 333 you understand all right so let's tap into your energy pisces sagittarius what what am i talking about hold on who's reading is this spirit <laughs> Okay, I said Pisces first, so we'll do Pisces. Sagittarius, I owe y'all a video, all right? If anybody is wondering why it's just Sagittarius and Pisces, it's because those were the only two signs that show love on this channel. If you have a different sign and you would like videos for your specific sign, you can either do a personal reading or y'all can watch the videos, like them, share them, you know what I'm saying? Otherwise, it's going to be straight up Pisces, Sagittarius, and Collective, all right? I love all of y'all, but all of y'all don't seem to love my ass, okay? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, so let's get into it, Pisces. Sag, you'll, you'll be next. One Pisces, one Sag today, okay? Spirit, help me tap into Pisces energy. Um, help me see what's going on with them. What is it that they need to know about? Um, the song that channel message, ch what channel song that I got before I, um, press record was, it's a little young dude. His name is Hulvey, H-U-L-V-E-Y. I don't remember the name of the song, but it goes, um, know your worth and don't play cheap. Uh, 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 don't play cheap. Quit trying to figure out what's next. Let that weight fall up off your chest. Know your worth and don't play cheap. Okay, so some about that. Know your worth, don't play cheap. Stop trying to figure everything out. Just l give it to God. Rest, okay? That's what I'm hearing. Like, whatever this concern is that you have, whether, you know, it's a collective reading, so it's going to be different for everybody, right? But, um, yeah, let that weight fall off your chest. Know your worth and don't play cheap. All right, so for some of you guys, it could be it could be a relationship. It could be a relationship with a lover or a boss, all right? So just put the energy where it goes because I'm hearing very much like, let's say this is a job for you, right? 
know your worth don't play cheap if you are charging for services okay you can even be an entrepreneur know your worth don't play cheap don't play yourself if you're in a relationship know your worth don't play cheap okay 505 on the clock all right spirit so show me pisces energy and what's going on with them please me and my baby about to go and get some sun y'all i hope y'all are getting out in nature nature is the most healing knight of pentacles yeah something is a slow start but it's stable right and then you got the seven of cups on the bottom of the deck what <laughs> all right anyway damn the knight of pentacles let's talk about this dude all right as most people know unless you're brand new to tarot the knight of pentacles is the slowest moving knight out of all the knights okay the pentacle though is grounded okay you got the queen of pentacles right here look at that mm. something about a teenager okay but anyway the knight of pentacles is the slowest moving knight in the deck i didn't even light any incense y'all um he takes his time he is tilling his land back there he's already tilled it you know what i'm saying if you look on the card you can see hold up back in the back you see he has that tilled land it took that mug a minute to do but it's because he's meticulous he pays attention to detail and he gets the shit done he just does it at a slower pace all right, so something could be coming in, but at a slow pace, or you could be moving at a slow pace, all right? Why is Pisces in this energy spirit? Hmm. Damn, it don't want to come out. All right, you've completed something. What? I didn't mean to say that, but maybe you did. But this is actually celebrating, okay? So maybe you're celebrating that you finally did something. You finally accomplished something, an offer, uh, uh, whatever it is, right? Just a minute. All right, something about red ribbons or something okay this right here is even making me think of my little bracelet okay so something for protection okay i feel like some of y'all put an offer in this could be possibly for a um a, a, a house a, a job okay whatever uh, then you got three again 33 that's more that master um master's energy yeah y'all are in a celebratory mood here come that damn devil poking his damn head out so what energies are coming towards pisces that they need to be aware of spirit I keep hearing that song let the weight fall off your chest know your worth and don't play cheap <laughs> Oh, sorry. What energies? What's going on with Pisces spirit? Oh, fuck. You got the five of cups, okay? Who is in this five of cups energy spirit? Who is this? Because Pisces over here celebrating. Mmm. Damn, y'all, look, another freaking double, 55. This is some form of lesson, some form. Okay, I heard blessing as well. All right, for you or for someone else. All right. Who is in this five of cups energy? The ace of cups. Give me another one, spirit, for Pisces, please. nine of swords what is this about spirit okay some form of movement some journey is what i heard i don't know if this is you or someone connected to you put the energy where it goes okay i feel as though someone may have turned down a love offer i don't see no love offers out here but i don't know that's just coming to me <clears throat> cancer could be significant here all right libra taurus 
Eternal Life is on by Londrell. He said, I got your soul, right? Damn, the Empress and the Queen of Pentacles. What? No, that's the Ace of Pentacles. So show me what's up with Pisces, Spirit. What is this? Somebody could be a distance away from you. All right. What is the Five of Cups about? Why? Who's sad? What's what they sad about? With the Nine of Swords. All right. Something about a hospital, emergency room, or an emergency vehicle. Okay. Give me another one for Pisces, please, with this Five of Cups. Somebody may have to move away or something, okay? You may have to move away. Someone else has to move away, possibly, okay? Mm. Yeah, some of y'all are really doing some research. This could be regarding, okay, I keep hearing something about a business venture, a business move, or something of that nature. Let's get some clarifiers out here, though. What is this in regards to spirit for Pisces, please? All right, some of y'all could have made an offer to something for something. All right, I heard y'all could have had an increase, made an offer to something, but the offer was possibly will be denied or was denied. Okay, I'm feeling as though if for those of y'all who resonates with this, this is for your higher good. For This is going to um, some level of growth or something I'm hearing. Okay, it has something to do with you and your home. This home could be your house or your body. You understand? Some of y'all are doing some real deep soul searching. Like, why the hell did this not work out? Some of y'all could feel like you're being punished. Okay. Because I'm feeling like you were like in a very, very good, like, yes. Mm, let's get it. Let's do this. Let's, mm-hmm. And then something occurred to where it's making you really in your feelings, stressed out and worried, wondering where is something going to come from. Okay. This is for your highest good. I know that sounds very much like, bitch, shut the fuck up, what you talking about? I understand I'm a Pisces too, okay? There's been a lot of crazy energies over here in our little, you know, in our little world. So I feel you, <laughs> all right? Spirit, what's going on here with Pisces? <laughs> you got 19. I'm going to look those up because this is, I don't know the deck by heart yet. I haven't used it enough. But you got 19 with 21 on the bottom. Now go that damn house. This could have something to do with your stability, your home. Okay. Then you got the lady up under that looking at a letter. Y'all, with a snake and the fucking rats and the bad health card what's going on here pisces what is this i told y'all it's something about a hospital or something or an ambulance or, or something the fuck let's see what 19 mean 19 is promise okay a promise Oh, I feel like, okay. Mm. Mm. The clasp hand. It says, I'm bound by my word. This card is about striking a deal and clear communication. Two parties cooperate to reach a mutually beneficial goal, whether it is a business arrangement, partnership, friendship, or even marriage. These are the everyday what practicalities of mutual support. The give and take that keeps the wheel rolling. All the promises we make in our relationships. Learn to trust and depend on other people and allow others to trust and depend on you. The question for this is, am I keeping my promise? Okay. And then it, definitely with the dog, you know, that's a loyal friend, right? A best friend, a loyal friend. Oh, shit. It's just turned. Be careful of the company you keep, okay? Know your worth and don't play cheap. 
again, whether this is in what they say, a partnership, business arrangement, friendship, or marriage, especially with this snake here and the rats. All right, be careful of the company you keep. Let's see what 21 is talking about. 21 is the dog. Okay. Mm -mm. The, um, mm. the dog represents the fool in the tarot cards. And the key word is loyal. If you are faithful, loyal, obsequi uh, what? obsequious, and a good friend okay you are faithful loyal obsequious and a good friend this card can indicate a good friend or someone who needs care in traditional tarot decks it is a dog who barks the warning to the fool that he is about to step off of a cliff and in this case the appearance of the dog card is a warning to look before you leap realize that you are taking a chance that will have far-reaching consequences tell me about this chance spirit Okay, and then the snake, my nigga, like, yo, hold up. Let's see what the snake talking about. Temptation. Mm. <laughs> mm. You must examine your conscience and spirituality if you are considering making a choice that you believe is too good to be true. The tempting energies of excess addiction and self-destructive behavior are present in the situation under question don't sell out for glitter you are probably right so beware of your of the hidden catch and strings attached don't let your weaknesses rule you know your worth and don't play cheap don't play cheap like whatever you set out to do pisces stick with that shit I'm telling you, spirits talking to me, I know for sure. Because I was definitely thinking about going back on my word about something. <sighs> and as bad as I want to do it. All right, spirit, I hear you. <laughs> but this could also be talking about people around you as well, okay? So just be careful. Look before you leap, okay? Know the uh, consequences of the, the actions that you take, okay? And definitely keep an eye out for your the company that you keep. All right. For me, what I I'm not gonna, you know, get into my story, but what this hermit card over here is definitely gonna make me take a moment to sit back and think like, why do I wanna do that? Why do I wanna break my word? You know what I'm saying? That's what the hermit card look at this shit, bro. I'm telling you. The hermit card is about it's about going in and you know what I'm saying, inner work. It's about figuring out what it is about yourself you know what i'm saying that causes you to do certain things okay this can also represent like to, i think of the moon as shadow work but i also look at the hermit as kind of like shadow work too you know what i'm saying like you yeah yeah it's a call here for you to take care of your house take care of your home your body all right some of you guys might need to get out in nature might need to go walking okay i don't know what, what? something about walking here climbing or something like that and look what it brings a rebirth a renewal a refreshing right all right don't forget to like the video comment share subscribe all that good shit it really helps me out and i really appreciate you guys so much if you would like to donate to the channel all of the information is down below cash app paypal um and also my email. All right. So I love y'all. I'll see y'all in the next video.